It's time to talk safety. The time between Thanksgiving and New Year's is reportedly one of the most dangerous times for roadway users. So what can we do to be safe? Rebecca Sustaida from MAD and Yako Ruiz, a victim of an impaired driver, they are here to discuss. Good to have you both with us on Sonoran Living. I want to start with you, Rebecca. Can you give us some statistics of impaired drivers? What are we talking about? What do the numbers look like? Yeah, so December is actually the most dangerous time to be on the roads. In 2021 in Arizona, just in the month of December, we had over 300,000 impaired drivers mm -hmm. just here in Arizona. And so it's a time where people are mostly on the roads, but unfortunately there's also a lot of impairment on the roads as well. Absolutely, and driving impaired is never, ever acceptable. Talk to us what that word impaired driver, what does that mean? Because it doesn't just mean alcohol. You're absolutely right. So impairment, it isn't just alcohol, it's also substances, so marijuana, but it could also be anything just as innocent as prescriptions or something like NyQuil. Um, if you turn the bottle over, it usually says do not operate a motor vehicle, and that's because something just like NyQuil or substances can start to alter your mind, so it's not safe for you to be out on the road. You're putting danger to yourself and to everybody else on the road. Very important information because someone thinks, oh, I just, you know, took some cold, you know, medication and then got behind the wheel. That can still alter how you perceive the road. R Yarko, thank you, first off, for being here well, and sharing you here. your story. Thank what you. happened to your daughter? I lost my daughter on June 1st of 2021 uh, due to a drunk driver. Um, uh, three days uh, later, uh, my daughter, uh, Yaren Aliyah, she lost her life you know, due to the injuries that she suffered in the car accident. So they were both of your daughters? Both of my daughters, were correct. In the car. Yeah, both of my daughters were on the back seat. And um, the night of June 1st, uh, a drunk driver actually struck them at a, a intersection. Mm. And you got that phone call? I did. And I you, did. You went to the hospital, and can you walk us through that pain? Um, it was definitely uh, the worst call any parent can can receive. Um, I was definitely in shock. I could not believe what you know what I was hearing, you know what I was seeing. You know, seeing both of my daughters, you know, laying down in bed in the hospital, you know, fighting for their lives is definitely something that I will never forget. Mm -hmm. And I I highly you know I recommend for people to find a designated driver you know this holiday season, right? I know this is the time where like. You know the most you know accidents happen and you know just be you know conscious of you know what you do and and just find someone that can drive you home your daughter had just celebrated her eighth birthday that is correct she had just barely turned eight years old and you know it rips families apart you know people make a split decision at that moment to get behind the wheel and you will live with this pain for the rest of your lives that is correct that is correct um i've been I've been living this, you know, for the past, you know, two, three years already, and it doesn't get easier. It doesn't get easier, um, you know. But you know, this is, you know, you know, today, you know, I just, I, I keep honoring her every day. Rebecca, how has Mad teamed up with Waymo to prevent families like this from going through this again? Yeah. So our ultimate goal, of course, is to make sure that families don't have to suffer just like Yarkos has. And so we've partnered with Waymo because they really are paving the way to have more sober drivers out on the roads and more options for people. So with their technology of autonomous vehicles, it's really allowing more opportunities for people to get that sober ride home designated yes. driver. And so we've partnered with them over the holiday season. Um, so you can use the code MADD, M-A-D-D 23, for two rides for 50% off to really just make sure that every family gets to celebrate the holiday season. Absolutely. Sure. Before you get behind the wheel, I encourage you to think of the Ruiz family. Thank you so much. We appreciate you both for being here. Waymo encouraging Valley Riders, you just heard, to designate the Waymo driver this holiday season. Please use promo code MAD, M-A-D-D 23. You will receive 50% off two rides. That is valid now through January 2nd, 2024. Learn more by going to mad.org Arizona. You can also learn more about Waymo by visiting waymo.com.